okay, who do you think this man of peace is going to be? Trump. Okay, Crystal. Concerning Trump, I want to make. I, I want this to be very clear. Okay. I believe. I believe that Donald Trump since 1981 was specifically chosen for a purpose. I don't know if it was by men or by gods or by both. But it was for a purpose. But that purpose has been fulfilled. He has awakened many by what he did and how the socialists are trying to take over the United States of America now. And, and uh, we see the distinctions, we see the differences in politics, we see, we see the differences. I, I don't want to go into the details. I don't want, because there's a lot of people, man, that are so, they get really embroiled, in, really embroiled in the politics, and I don't. But um, he's not necessary anymore. But yes, somebody is coming who's going to fulfill the exact same role. They're going to be construed as a man of peace. It could be him, yes. We only have 19 years left. The four, the four horsemen of the apocalypse have to happen before May 16th, 2040. So yes, it could be him. But it could be another. He just set things in motion. He set the trap, is what he did. And the enemy fell in it. And after they realized they fell in it, they are controlled by even a greater, more ancient enemy. And we're not defeating them. The good guys aren't defeating them at all. They're just going to go into hiding deeper in their biospheres. And they're going to wait it out. And they're going to let, it's a false confidence, they're going to let the enemy, us, and the good guys, believe that they've won when they haven't.